All right, so since I can't record and or stream the game all the time, when I'm playing it on my own, I'm trying to get footage of the most interesting part of my playthrough. So in part six, I got to listen to a few uh, recorded messages. And so, uh, okay, let's listen to them here. Everyone will be provided a safe transit as soon as possible. This is an automated recording sent from K23, the Crown Station. It's a week since the last working escape pod left. There is still the one pod left, but we have uninstalled the fuel cells just in case. Do not use the pod. This is an automated recording sent from K23, the Crown Station. And then I got this quest. There is a note in the dossier. Hey guys, it seems I forgot the key in the pocket of my pants. My wife must have put them in the washing machine, so it seems the shipment will be late. Sorry. And so I went and tried to find the key in a washing machine in the area, while of course I've been dismantling some stuff. So the key was here. And then I was able to go in the storage area where there was many phones and phones uh, rhyme with electronic parts. Well, actually, it doesn't rhyme at all, but this is what there was here. The key unlocks a door leading to a storage full of materials. One man's misfortune seems to be another man's fortune. So, yeah, I got quite a few electronic parts here to be able to upgrade and create some new stuff. After dismantling uh, all of those phones and stuff in the warehouse, I stumbled upon another myth tablet, where we could get a bit more of the lore of the game. The bringer of great knowledge, the one-armed king, descended to us from the skies. We welcomed the king to our tribe. We greeted him as one of our own. And then I got to fight the vicious twins. Uh, it's a boss fight. Uh, I did I did succeed the first time I tried, but uh, I did run away for quite some time before engaging them. Uh, I wasn't sure of how to uh, tackle the fight. Um, but it went well in the end. I've won, of course. Um, it was not easy, but I think I'm getting the hang of combat. Uh, you know, it's it's very let them slash, hit them, run away, slash, hit them, run away. Uh, once you you get that, uh, it works on pretty much every uh, every enemies in, in the game. So, uh, yeah. It was a great fight though, I enjoyed it. And uh, part 7 is already uh, recorded. I did a live stream today with uh, Ishan and Derry uh, talking to me in chat. It was quite uh, it was quite fun. I got to make a new hat to be able to sustain the cold. So yeah. Went to the north. So I wish I could live stream all out of the game but uh, because sometimes i'm playing on the bus or during my lunch break uh, it, it's just not possible and recording the gameplay on my phone is uh, kind of uh, heavy on uh, phone usage uh, data storage anyway so here i just wanted to show you there's a lot of 
env environmental storytelling. See those rocks they're making in Harrow, and there was a treasure to dig. Uh, I've stumbled also on a kind of spooky deer uh, that if, if I was following him, he would then scratch the floor and tell me to dig there. So anyway, that was part six. Thanks for watching and bye-bye.